Hello everyone, once again, I am back with more Super Paper Mario, basically. Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, I don't know, I just kind of said the first title that came to mind. <laughs> anyway, so let's go down to sub level 4, because I think that's where we need to go. Room. What is room for? There are beds and lockers we can't have here. But nothing else, really. The weird thing is, it kind of smells nice in here, huh? Why do you think that is? This is a shower room? I guess every evil guy base of Ultimate Doom needs one. Just because you're evil doesn't mean you enjoy BO, you know what I mean? <laughs> This is what you're saying, pretty far beneath the surface of the moon, huh? I mean, I hate Grotus, but I gotta give him some props for a pretty cool evil hideout. <laughs> Are you not? It is pleasant to meet you. I am the main computer of this fortress. I am Tech. I must tell you something. That is why I brought you to this place. Princess Peach. I, I am sorry. Most of my data was er erased, <coughs> and my main power unit was shut down. Now running on backup power with only cache memory. Trying to stay operational. Mario, you know that Peach is not here, do you not? Please say Peach. Please, please. Princess Peach is with Grotus in the Palace of Shadow. I had to tell you that. But, backup power failing. Mario, use the teleporter room to get back to report. Teleporter room is on sub level 2 of the fortress. I will release the room lock. Peach is in the Palace of Shadow? Please hurry. There is barely enough power left to activate the teleporter. I will cease all AI functions to send power to the teleporter for you. But what will happen to you? When the power is all gone, I will cease to exist as an artificial consciousness. But, if it will save Peach, I would gladly do this. Because until I met Peach, I knew nothing of love. Do not worry about me. I am just a computer. Just a machine. Mara, you must save Peach. I ask you please. And tell her... Thank you for me. No. Oh. We understand, Tech. So, hurry to the teleporter room now. Mario, save her. Tech system failure reported. Mario, we have to save Peach for poor Tech, too. Oh, yeah. This is the computer room. This must be where Princess Peach met with Tech. Yes. 
Now, before you leave this place, make sure you've gathered up all the items you wanted to here. Because you can't come back here after you, uh, go to the teleporter. As far as I know, we've got everything, so I'm gonna go to the teleporter. But, uh, um, yeah. Some kind of teleporter, who knows where that thing would send us. I think that's what the next one's used to go between food and here. I think we have to switch it on and then stand on the platform to use it. But yeah, I'm pretty sure we got everything. Goodbye. Yeah, it blows up. Uh, am I going to... Am I go totally going nuts? Or oh, did I hear something just now? So you try powering it back on, it doesn't react whatsoever. Apparently it doesn't work. <laughs> well, if it isn't Mario. Over here, son. You brought the crystal star back on the moon with you, didn't you? What? Talking to my good ear, the x Men Fortress was on the moon? Ah, oh, yes. So Princess Peach was there too, I assume. Well, she was, but the x Men boss took her and headed for the Thousand Year Door. Aha! Just a bit ago, I smelled some rank air and went to the Thousand Year Door. I saw a suspicious fellow in a cave go through the door with Princess Peach. Well, what? No way! I thought this seven crystal door, the door I shouldn't have opened, though. Believe me, I know, but I'm quite certain of it. I saw it with my own eyes. I have a very bad feeling about this. Very bad. Prince Peach is in danger. Time is short. We must go to the Thousand Year Door and rescue the princess. I'll run ahead and meet you there. Don't dawdle. You must come immediately. Might as well. We're not ready to move on in the game yet. RDM final issue. Vote for today. In a shocking series of events today, local authorities report that Zest age 55, delivered a left hook to the jaw of Godabot Flavio late this afternoon. <laughs> Our investigation has revealed that the cause of this feisty fisticuffs may have been Zesty's anger that a shipment of gourmet ingredients spoiled on the dock because Flavio had held up the dock crew with a marathon two day tale of high seas adventure. While Flavio is recovering from temporary memory loss, Zesty has already been approached by a glitz pit talent scout, Don Gumbadi. I think the kids got spun. We'll take the world by storm, said Gumbadi. <laughs> this week we have an explosive exclusive on the shop in the Fallout Outpost, North Winds Mart. It's so cold there that all the merchandise is frozen to the counter. Just kidding, the smiling shop manager showed us a fascinating, fascinating variety of goods, as a sweet face a little miss explained. It's cold out, but I do my best to explode inside shop to warm place up, duh. So come on in. This place is big, too, folks, so we haven't even seen all of it yet. Come on down and see it for yourself. This is the final installment of Cooking for Rookies. Just to make sure we leave you with a smile on your face, our last recipe will be a couple's cake. Just simmer spicy soup for a few minutes, then drop in a snow bunny and presto, before your very eyes, the mister mixture will congeal and take the form of a cake. <laughs> this is it, dear readers, the final issue. We were here, we here at the RDM office have enjoyed every minute of our hard work to bring you the best news and features. May we meet again, perhaps sooner than you think. Wink, wink. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, long time, no spook. It is I, the spirit from the Excess Express. I bet you're wondering how an eth ethereal being like myself can type an email. Well, I actually possess the train conductor to do it. Oh, ho, 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 don't worry, though. He's doing just fine. 
I think maybe I'll do my new diary like this. Email's convenient, you know? And leaving a record of my afterlife is cool in a spiritual sense, I mean. So, good luck with your quest. It's not yet time for you to come over to my side. <coughs> but whatever you do, I'll welcome you. Oh, farewell. <laughs> That's funny. Did I forget to read any of these? Apparently not. Okay, good. Alright. This is gonna be a short one, so, um, that way I can turn off the system. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed these, and, um, I'm gonna take a break from Mario so that I can do another game. Um, like I said, I'm going to be focusing on games that I haven't played in a while, so, um, look forward to that. Um, and these will be uploaded as soon as possible, like I said, so, uh, they will probably be showing up in your subscription box very soon. <laughs> if not already. Well, this one will already have when I say that, but I mean, like, the other ones should have appeared in your subscription box. Unless you, um, unsubscribed from this channel for whatever reason. And you're not, and you're still on the fence about subscribing back, so you're wondering if this is going to come back for real. <laughs> I'm going to do my best to bring this back, I promise. But anyway, for now, I will see you guys in the next thing I do. Till then, everyone.